Hey you guys, it's Rachel here with Life of Senza. Um, so I'm out here with some of the dogs. Savannah and I just um, got back from doing some grocery shopping. She's right there. And um, did, some, did some errands today. And, uh, hmm. So I'm, I'm watching, seeing if she's gonna let this dog in. What's happening here? Izzy! <coughs> oh, what a sweet girl. Here. Ah, switch! Don't you eat that tree. Psh, don't eat the tree. She's over here with the birds. She's right here, Savannah. Okay. Nirvana, leave her alone. So I've got Switch out here. Oh Lord. She's only about a year old now. Well, almost a year, not quite a year. Nirvana, why you gotta be such a punk? Oh, she always gotta dominate. She's so... So ridiculously dramatic. She's not hurting the dog. She's not even leaving a mark on her. And as you can see, Switch could care less. Um, in fact, Nirvana's like insulted by her, by her lack of care. But oh, watch, I man, she almost took out my legs. Switch is looking really good. She's um, maturing extremely well. She's not the biggest dog, but she's not small either. And she's still just a puppy. So she may very well um, get bigger. I mean, she, excuse me, she'll definitely get bigger just how much, I don't know. Um, she's actually bigger than I thought she was now that I look at her. Nirvana, if you don't get, I've had it. You've made your point. I let you do it. Now get you. Don't sass me, child. Yeah, no, I really don't care. I love you, but you are not going to, like, try to... Oh, my God, they're so beautiful. You ain't even got babies and you already got milk. What's up with that? Izzy! Hi, Bobby! <whistles> oh, man, they almost took out my tree. Now, Izzy is about to get in trouble. Help me watch this fence line. Because Nirvana is going to be the one to come after her the way she's running. She's going to get in trouble. The way she's excited like that. She's going to get in trouble. You don't get to be excited like that. Izzy, come here. Come here. Let me see that collar. Come here. Izzy. Hey, 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 hey. Watch out now. Almost. Oh, it's gonna happen. Hold on now. Hold on now. Hold on now. Hold on now. Let me see. Nirvana, leave her alone. There we go. <clears throat> That's my velocity. That's my velocity daughter. Nirvana, that's enough. Get. Hey, what did I say? You. Do I need to make my point? You've, you've done enough. She's so dramatic. I mean, I don't, the thing about it is, is like these pups haven't been out. And so that's a very normal thing for her to come in and she's not hurting them. She's making a bunch of racket, but that's, and that's why I zoomed in because I wanted you to be able to see that she's not actually doing anything. She's doing what I call a mouth bite. Um, and that's one of the things I simulate with my dogs with my hand, um, as a, like a disciplinary thing. But, um, pshht. Yeah, she's so the thing about Nirvana that I like is that while Nirvana 
seems more aggressive than her mother, she's actually not. And when she gives mouth bites, she doesn't make a connection. Like she doesn't actually bite. Whereas her mother will. Her mom, she won't like seriously injure a dog, but she will like put a hole in their face, um, which is very normal for, for any kind of pack animal as far as like wolves, cane, things like that, um, canines, like they they do that. I mean, wolves often have very scarred up faces, particularly the lower pack members. So, Izzy, she's like, what is this? It's one of the trees that I planted. So what I wanted to talk about today was how much my mind has changed and how much differently I feel about moving now. Um, and I was really looking at the home prices and stuff like that and considering everything that I've done like to fix my house. I bought my house for a real bargain. Um, I got it um, very cheap because so much needed to be done. Like it needed, it needed um, a new AC, it needed the whole underside of the house, like the moisture barrier needed to be completely redone. Insulation, um, all at the, in the seat, in the, in the attic needed to be redone. The AC, um, all of the AC vents and everything upstairs, I redid. Uh, what else? The only thing we haven't done yet is the roof. It's not like major, obviously. It's not a um, major repair, but it does need to be replaced. And so, and then I've also done a lot of gardening and just the property looks better. So all in all, um, the, with the amount of stuff I've done, like there's very little that I would have to do left. And so I'm just going to do those things. I'm going to finish painting and probably just um, install new carpet um, upstairs. And then, the, and then instead of doing, I wasn't going to do carpet on the stairs, but since I'm moving, I'm just going to just re-carpet the stairs and really just get it um, to where you know, it looks really nice, um, which shouldn't be too hard considering everything I've done already, which I haven't even shown you guys. I said, I said I was going to do a house tour, but uh, gosh, with everything going on, man, I haven't had the ability, but, um, but I will before I sell it, like I did with the old house. And I guess it's just, um, originally I felt very, um, sad and this and that. And, um, now I just feel empowered. I did, I, I realized that because I was so emotional, I, when I was reading a lot of the other counties, I wasn't really reading them thoroughly. And so what I found is that there's areas very close to me that have, they still have a permit process, but it's not the same type of permit. It's called a conditional permit, which means that as long as you meet the conditions, you can be there. Whereas here, it's a special use permit, meaning that basically they don't want you here, but if you get like special permission or whatever, they'll let you. So, so anyway, so it's a, it's a much easier process over there. There's a path to success where over here, it's really just, you know, it's just not. So, um, so anyway, so it is what it is. Like I'm, um, I'm fine. I'm okay. I feel today's the first day that I really feel better and I'm just going to really focus on trying to do what I did to my last house, which is do the things that I can do to make it look really nice. I'll do some more gardening in the front of the house and, um, and, uh, just, you know, just make things look as nice as possible, as fast as possible so that I can sell and then move on to my um, house where, and honestly, like, I think one of the really cool things about being here was that I got to experience the seasons so that I know what to expect so, um, from my kennels and just from everything. And like, I think that like going forward, you know, not yet, if possible, like I would rather live in a, like a, like a one story, or at least if I was in a two story, I'd rather my bedroom be downstairs um, I don't think I need as big of a house as this. I'm going to be honest with you. Like Savannah and I really don't even use probably half this house, um, because past her hallway or past her room is just a hallway full of rooms that we don't use. And we've just really been using them for storage, which is, you know, pretty ridiculous. So 
it really wasn't as much as I loved it here when I really sit and look at it it really wasn't the best fit um give that baby some love Izzy Isabel Izzy um so anyway so um so like I said, I've accepted it. I'm fine with it. I'm good. I'm excited about the future and, and of using what I've learned to be able to make better decisions going forward as to what best suits my um, needs. And I think that with what I've done so far in this house and the little things that need to be done once I'm, once I'm done with this house, I very well could walk away with, um, with a substantial amount of, of, of money. So maybe, you know, it was all for good reason and we'll just have to see. And I know that I've learned a lot being here. And, um, and so anyway, so I guess that's, I guess that's where it's at. That's kind of where, I, where I'm at with it. So I hope that you guys are having a good day and I will talk at you later. What was that, Savannah? I'll zoom my eyebrow raised. You're zooming in on me right now. No, I'm not. You better not. I'm not zooming. <laughs> anyway, bye y'all.